Should I? Yes, Mr. Speher. I had noticed. I suggest that we keep moving as well. Obi-Wan, ready the ship. The priestess of the wood and I are heading your way. We're not alone. It sounds like negotiations didn't go well. There is little middle ground between cutting down a tree and not cutting down a tree. And Mistress Taher's opposition seems willing to cut down anyone who stands in their way. The Master Jedi! We appear to be surrounded. <laughs> your word or your blood, Mistress Thayer. The trees will fall with one or the other. You think that you can face the might of a Jedi warrior? You and your blasphemy will be... What are you? I was sent to find a peaceful solution to your people's problem, mistress. This is clearly not a time or place where cooler heads will prevail. Don't let escape! Hang on, mistress. How oh, dare you! Take us up! Where are we heading, master? Back to Corazon. I cannot abandon my trees to the Metal Clan! By your own laws, by their own admission, they need your word or your blood to harm a single leaf. For now, they shall have access to neither. Oh, a city of metal? Of course. Why have you brought me to this abomination of a world? You will be safe here for the time being. I will be safe when every member of the Metal Clan is dead. Strike them down with your lightsaber. End this conflict. That is not the way of the Jedi, Mistress. But you fought for me! You chose my side! I defended your life. Whatever you may think, I... I had heard the Jedis were great warriors. But running at the first sign of a fight? The legends never hinted at your cowardice. Master Qui-Gon, your report, the Council requests... Master Yoda, surely you did not track me down for a mere report, especially when my Padawan has been so diligent in filing his own. No, great turmoil I sense in you, and knew it is not. If I am to be honest, this mission, the words of the Priestess of Wood, there are concerns that I have had for some time now. A coward you are not, Qui-Gon Jinn. Her planet, you had to leave. Being called a coward isn't what bothered me, Master Yoda. It was being called a great warrior. Hmm. Even here on Coruscant, the home of the Jedi Council, there is little understanding of our purpose. We are seen as soldiers, servants of politicians, with little mention of the Force itself. Mysterious the Force remains to many, and misunderstood those who use the Force often are. And yet, our actions are a reflection of our purpose. Perhaps the Jedi Council residing here in the capital is part of the problem. We are used as a weapon of the Republic, and thus we are seen as such. Perhaps even by ourselves. On this point, the Council would not agree. Of course. But, be it the Council or myself, they feel there is a lack of vision. Hmm. When questions we have, a deeper understanding from the Force we must seek. On that, we agree, Master Yoda. <laughs> <laughs>